Ah, sí, lo fuimos a dejar, va. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Irene. Hello, Julia. Hello. How was your day? Good day. Good, A good day. day. All yeah. these days are excellent for you, Julia. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I admit it. Yeah. yeah. Good, good. I could live, yeah, I could live like this, whatever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, especially with this weather, you enjoy your vacation more. Yeah. 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 I'm yeah. totally happy. Yeah. Yeah, good, good, good. And when do you return to your office? December 2nd. Oh, my goodness. So you have like 15 more days. Exactly. Good. Good. Yeah. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Thank you, teacher. Hey, yeah. by the way, I have a question yeah. of the, uh, the final exam of the, yeah. of the platform. Yeah. It's on the final uh, the final exam on the part, the letter C, uh -huh. part two, number two, it says, by January, Paula, and their answer, as according to the, the platform, it will have been studied. I uh, we have been studying Japanese for four years, but mm -hmm. you told us that when you, when you use press no, future present continuous, uh -huh. the verb will be ending in ing, exactly. and the platform says will have been studied yeah. because if you write a studying, it, it doesn't uh, it, accept it exactly. But yeah. just to be sure, but uh, just to be sure about the verb, yes. it's just starting. Yes, okay. yes. And remember, the uh, the platform has mistakes, and and that is good that you know, like, but this is not good, you know. But if the platform accepts only the wrong version, then you need to type the wrong version. But what? Yeah, what... I tried. Believe uh -huh. me, I. To be honest, I use, I even use Google, Google trans, uh, the translator of it. Uh, right, right. But yeah, but I didn't get the, like, the right answer. Yeah. So, okay, I'm going to try to study it. Yeah, exactly. That's the yeah. answer. Yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, so, wanna... so the person putting the information in the platform made a mistake. So therefore, uh, the platform, you know, the, the wrong answer is right, you know? Yeah. So... Yeah, That's... but it takes like 30 minutes of my life, but it's okay. Yeah. I have all the time. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you're right. Uh, the correct form should be with the ING form. We all have been studying. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Yes. All right. Um, anybody else has any other comments or questions about the platform? No. Remember yeah. that um, you have until Thursday night to finish the platform. I had the same problem as Julia because I tried to answer a part of the questions, but I repeat, repeat, repeat in the, in the lunch time, but 
Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. So uh, it happens. It happens. And uh, but what counts the most is that you have the correct answer here. Right. So but OK. Any other questions or comments? No. OK. So let's begin with our first activity. First activity is about reading. Mm -hmm. Okay, and it's right here. Loading, loading, loading. All right, can you see the article? Yes. Okay. Do you remember reading this article in the platform? Uh, I, I think so, yes, yes. Okay. The name of the article is Get Yourself Lost. Who read this article uh, in the platform? I. Okay. So when does this article apply? To which event does this article apply? Get yourself lost. What's the meaning of that? If you travel to another country for uh, spend your your mind or uh -huh. your your mind out, I don't know. Uh huh. So, uh, like you have to rest and and know about other cultures or experience than when you travel and you forgot all the bad uh, situations that you have right now, I don't know. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Someone else, another opinion? Get yourself lost. So if you go to Costa Rica, get yourself lost. If you go to Mexico, get yourself lost. So what is the meaning of that? Is it literal? Mm, rest? Exactly. Yes, it is literal. So, like, look, I don't know anybody there. It's going to be my first time. Don't worry. Go get lost. Get yourself lost. Okay. So, we're going to be doing uh, some reading. We're going to be practicing pronunciation. I need a volunteer to read the first paragraph, please. Travelers. Okay. All right. Go ahead, Mario. Travelers to a new city are often in, encouraged to take a bus tour. The thinking is that they can later return to the places that they captivated. Captivated them, but that no sense. What you see from the inside of a fast moving bus is sanitized and unreal. Utterly, utterly, utterly removed from the authentic sight, sounds, and smells outside. Excellent. Very good. Any questions there? Utterly. Utterly, it's, um, it's another form to say completely. Entirely. Entirely. Okay. Yes. Okay. Anybody else? Any comments or questions? Captivated. Uh, Captivated? It's like a... It's the same meaning that we have in Spanish, captival. Uh -huh. Right? Like they capture your attention. Mm -hmm. Yes. Captivado or cautivado? Cautivado. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What did I say? <laughs> Really? <laughs> okay, count you out. Okay, so let's go a little bit long, so I will read here. So the next volunteer is going to read um, until the word courtyards. The best way, volunteer. Me, teacher. Go ahead, please. 
The best way to experience any destination is by food, without an itinerary, wandering where your spirit led you. Even in the larger cities, the savvy, savvy, yeah, savvy, the savvy, mm -hmm. traveler plunges. plunges into the very center of town and walks down the nearest street, experiencing the after life of the people while looking into the grocery store and counter. Thank you. Any questions mm -hmm. there? Plunges. 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 Plunges and courtyards. Okay. Uh, how do you say la taza del baño está tapada? <laughs> the toilet is? Duck. Suck. Club. Suck. The no, toilet no, is clogged. Like, like, like coagulo? Right, right. So you, you are. Oh my goodness. You, you flush the toilet and the water is not going anywhere. That is a sign that the, the, the uh -huh. toilet is clogged. How do you fix this problem? You get yourself a plunger. So plunge means mm. to push uh, fast. Push fast, plunger, uh, plunger. So plunger. It, right. So even in the largest cities, the savvy traveler pushes into the very center. So uh, when you push someone by making force, something by making force. Uh -huh. Yeah. So that is plunges. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. What is the meaning of savvy? Savius. Yeah. I think it's some, uh, something related like with luxury. I'm not, I'm not sure. Savvy is, is a, a, someone that has a lot of knowledge about a particular topic. So a system engineer is computer savvy. Right? Any other questions? No. No? Right. How about the courtyards? Okay, does anybody know the meaning of courtyards? Only Oscar um, asked, so I think the others, they know the word. Do you? No, I don't know. Okay. No, it's not clear for me, but okay, courtyard. The courtyards is, is, in this case, they're making reference to big open uh, spaces that are usually surrounded by walls. Mm -hmm. that, that's a courtyard. Like similar to um, La Gran Via. You, you see there is a lot of space where people walk, but on the sides mm -hmm. there is always a, a, a wall or business. A wall. That's a courtyard. Courtyard, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So when the when the, the hotel that is in La Gran Villa is the Hyatt Courtyard? Uh-huh. Right. Uh -huh. what, what does it mean by uh, the hotel like that? That is located in a courtyard. That's a very good uh -huh. example. Because if you analyze La Gran Villa, that's a big courtyard. Mm -hmm. That's a courtyard. So they make right. reference to the to the place where they are, to their location. So is, you have a fence all around the perimeter. Uh, not, not, not necessarily a fence, but usually walls. Walls. Yes. Okay. Exactly. Because because I I have seen hotels that are courtyards that are in the in the middle of nothing, just a hotel. Okay. And the surrounding is a forest, so they call it courtyards also. Okay. Let me. Okay. Let me, um, okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> I didn't mean to bother too much. No, 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 no. <laughs> this is uh, everybody's class. So everybody's feel, feel uh, free to make. Uh, so this is a courtyard. Let's see, 
courtyard. Yes. So you're talking about spaces that are usually surrounded by walls. Like terraza, uh, Not exactly a terraza, but uh, uh, okay. But it's it's usually space where people can walk, and uh, it's surrounded by walls. That's a courtyard. Okay. Yeah. Courtyard. Yep. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I thought it was like a kind of golf camp, but it's a courtyard. Okay? Yeah, it, yeah, it's a courtyard. Yes. I got it now. All right, good. So, uh, where's the reading? Where's the reading? Right here. Okay. So, court right here. Okay. Here, the next part, please. You eventually. Uh -huh. Okay, me. Yes, go ahead. You eventually get to many of the same sites that are on the bus road, the museums, the monuments, the city hall, but you will have witnessed so witnessed? much more uh -huh. because witnessed, witnessed uh -huh. so much more because you will have left the contemporary life of the city. You are visiting. Okay, good. Any questions there? Do you guys remember the meaning of the word eventually? Eventually is not eventualmente. What is eventually? Este, tarde o temprano. Um, kind of. So uh, let's say you, you go to the gym every day, eventually you will get muscles. If, uh -huh. if you have a, a, a nice diet, eventually you will lose weight. So what is eventually? At the end. At the end, uh -huh. Yeah, eventually as means result, at the end, at the as end. a result, yes. Okay. Eventually means at the end. Mm -hmm. Nice. Uh, okay. All right. So how do you say eventualmente in English? If it's not eventually. eventually. Oh, at the end. You will say occasionally. Occasionally. Is this is a, a synonym of eventually? Now, if you want to say eventualmente in English, you say occasionally. Okay. Right? Because when you say eventualmente, it's like not all the time, only on particular occasions. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Any other questions or comments? You can Eventually. say something too, teacher. Sure, please. As a result. Yeah, somebody said something? Uh, yes. If I if, uh, Occasionally, like sometimes, or no, it's different. Yeah, sometimes, but occasionally is less than sometimes because sometimes represents 50%. Now, occasionally will be like 35 or 40%, so it's less. Okay. Yes. Okay, any other questions or comments? No. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. I need another volunteer to read the next paragraph. But what if I get... I am going to read it. Yes, please. Okay. Okay. But what if I get lost? People ask. No one ever get permanently lost in a major city. Eventually... A uh, trolley or bus pass with the words Central Station on its front, and you can easily return to the center of town. Besides, the most wonderful things can happen if you do get lost, such as stopping at Sewell Cafe to sit and relax, and then asking direction from the locals at the next table. Hopefully, your trip may be enhanced, enhanced, enhanced. enhanced by this encounter. Here are a few ways to make the most of your travels. Thank you. 
All right, do we have any questions here? Enhance and encounter. Okay, enhance is a synonym of improve. Enhance. Improve. And encounter is like in Spanish, encuentro. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Sure. Anybody else has other comments? Um, sidewalk. Sidewalk. Uh, sidewalk is the place where people walk next to the street. Oh, okay. Yes. Mm, okay. Like acera? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. A anybody else? Any other questions? No. Okay, so let's continue with the with the some of the advice they're giving. Know before you go. Another volunteer, please. Mm -hmm. Now before you go. Before you depart, spend time in the library or bookstore learning about the learning about the uh huh history and culture of your destination so you will be better understand the place you're visiting okay read the next one please move around look move around like a local use the local subways trams and buses you will not only save money you will learn how people live there and you will gain a realistic perspective of the city excellent thank you any questions here No. No. Okay. Here to read uh, two. Check the bulletin boards. Mm -hmm. Let's see who hasn't said anything. Okay, go ahead, please. Uh, check the bulletin boards. Bulletin board leads free lecture, concert, workshops, and social gathering giving you a chance to join or meet the area's most dyna dynamic residents. Okay. Next one, please. Take a walking tour. If you, if you most book a guided tour, select the non-standard, inexpensive kind conducted on foot. Thank you. Any questions there about the part Veronica just read? Non, non standard. Yeah, like non standard. It, it, here they make reference to a uh, cheap. Okay. Because uh, when you uh, when you you visit another city, you visit another country you request a tourist guide. You know, a tourist guide, they will usually charge you uh, uh, a certain amount of, of money. But if you select the non-standard, it's like, you know, it's, it's cheaper. It's cheaper. The non-standard. Okay, thank you. Do you guys remember the meaning of the word lectures? Lectures is not lecturas. It's a, um, it's a, a class in the university or a college. Uh, yeah, it, yeah, it can be a, a class in the university. It can be a class in a regular school. It can be a, a, a lecture is a sermon. Okay. A lecture is a sermon. It can be in a university. It can be in a church. It can be in your office. So if, if I come to my house at 2 a.m., my wife will lecture me. <laughs> so, uh, she will lecture me. Yeah, so she'll be like, woo, 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 and all that. Okay, any questions? No? Okay, this is... All right, this is and the last... Okay. What is it? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, 
you should, you were saying something oh, else I'm sorry I was on mute uh, I was thinking on that this is a guide for a first world I mean I wouldn't do this in Mexico right or or, or, or in El Salvador or in El Salvador no you, you need a a good father. A, you need a guy. A, a guy, a, a, un, a padrino uh, or a madrina to take you to the Right. To the places. They know where to go <laughs> and where not to. Mm -hmm. So the locals, they know what to be. They, they are in their own uh, world, you know, so they know what to do. All right. And vo another volunteer to read the last part. So the next time, let's see, Rocio, can you help next us time, read? The next time. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Nubia? Uh, or Julia, anybody? Uh, so the next time, for the next time you feel Lord, Lord by Lord. a size. Lord. 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 Uh -huh. By a by uh -huh. a sizing, sizing. bus tour. tour. You save your money and in wander Instead. around on your. Uh -huh. Huh? Yeah. I promise you a time you remember fondly. Exactly. Thank you. Any questions in the last part? Lurt? Uh, Lurt is another form of saying um, attracted. If you feel attracted. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Wonder. Wonder means to go without a particular destiny. So you're wandering, you're walking around. Ah, uh, okay, like wandering. Uh, like wander, like vagar. Ah, uh, okay, That's wander. vagar, wander. Wander, 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 vagar, vagar. So when you go oh. vagar, when you go vagar, you don't have any particular destiny, you just go wherever. I just wonder, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got it. And let me see. The lure. Lure. Lure is attractive. Attractive, yes. And allure. Allure. Uh huh. Maybe it's an adjective that makes a reference to the person. I think. Allure. Okay. Allure. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, Anybody oh. else? Any other questions or comments? Fondly. Fondly. Fondly, Fondly. like deeply. 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 Profundamente. Deeply. Okay. Yes. All right. Um, any other questions or comments about this article? No. All right, so I will give you five minutes so you guys can paraphrase um, this here. Let me see, where is this here? Uh -huh. Breakout rooms. So just paraphrase what you understand and see if. Uh, any of these tips you have experienced before. So let's do the speaking.
like uh, for example the public transportation to go to one side to other side and if you feel lost you can try to ask for a, a city sense or or watching a map i don't know something like that but for example for me when i when i travel to another country uh, i always try to use google maps and they uh, they say me that if you use uh, a public transportation hello 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 <laughs> i think nuya have problems with uh, connection oh okay so what is your yeah. opinion about the article williams okay um that is a good way in this country <laughs> yeah especially especially if you are a foreign because uh, we don't have uh, a safe country no um, it is sad but is a reality for us right so uh, so uh, if you are in another country it's a good way to know more about uh, the places around so uh, but if you know someone someone local who can help you to know different places is better because uh, they know what is the best places to visit for the tourists and um, they know the uh, what is the the places the uh, expensive places or the most cheap uh, right. places so uh, you can have um, a better trip I think Right, definitely, definitely. Yeah, and it's better when you travel to a place, if you already know somebody there, that's, that's, that's even better because you don't have to be like getting lost and everything. But, you know, like you said, it doesn't apply here in El Salvador because, you know, we don't have uh, safe places, complete safe places. Exactly. Yep. exactly. Nuvia, can you yeah. hear me? Yeah, okay, so let me move you with someone else, William. Okay. I will send you to room one. And I will send Nubia to room three. With a tour guide, I mean with a friend who knows the play with a local, with a local. Yes, because like you were saying, is dangerous if you go by your by your own. You don't know the place. You could be ending in a in a dangerous street or something like that. Uh huh. Someone can even stole. Mm -hmm. you know even in 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 big countries you can get in trouble. You, what what happen if you go to a to a town, I mean, to a China, to, to I don't know. Yeah, so, big cities have uh, dangerous places uh -huh. uh, in the United States, Canada. Uh -huh. Yep. I want to, uh, I want to say it uh, not in an offensive way because I, right. I think I'm tolerant, I'm uh -huh. tolerant. But I, but to say the truth, there are so many neighborhoods in in the new U.S. cities. Yeah that are really dangerous uh, they're dangerous there are so many robberies uh crime i mean uh, prostitution murders. drugs uh-huh so i will check what place can i right. go before before right. doing as i see by walking uh -huh. exactly <laughs> <laughs> it's true uh, so this but the, the same happens but but uh, Different, different uh, food, the different uh, countries. Yes, yes. Even uh, I, 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 I know that Guatemala is near here, but yes. if, you, if you go to Guatemala, you can taste the, the different flavors of the food. It's different. Yes. <laughs> It's different. The, the, the clima, what do you say, clima? Weather. Uh, weather. Yes, the different weather. It's very rich. 
Ah, yes. The weather uh, uh, of Guatemala. Yes. I like it. Uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> it's, it's cold sometimes and it's uh, yes. cool. <laughs> sometimes. Yes. Right or left. And if ah. you and if you and if you don't know the the way that you have to take, probably you get lost easily there. Yes, it's very difficult. Yes. Uh, if you travel alone is is it worse. <laughs> yes. But in, in Central America? Yes. What is the air gauge? Behind? Yes, behind of Galerias. I don't remember the name of the street. And you have uh, one in the Zona Rosa next to Vidri. Okay. It's expensive, but yeah, I like more than La Pampa Argentina, for example, that it's, it's too expensive. It doesn't worth it. I never gone there. I will try the next time. <laughs> yeah, for a special yeah. occasion, for a birthday, or stuff. Something yes, like that. Yes. Ah, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hello, teacher. Oh, Hi. How, how is the how is the flies with this? Uh, how do you say, lluvia? Rain. Rain. Yes. Uh -huh. okay. I don't know where you are, but here at, the, at San Salvador, for next to the military hospital, it's raining. Is it raining right rain. now? Really? Yeah, it's a light rain, a light, light one. Okay. Yeah, but it's, it's yeah, yeah, it's raining. Okay. I don't know what is the forecast for tomorrow. Uh, well, they said that uh, um, that the the tropical rain, tropical storm, will be leaving El Salvador, uh, but I haven't read how many more hours we will have uh, more rain. So, oh. uh, where are you, Daniel? Uh, yeah. He's driving. I'm, I'm, I'm driving. That? I'm, I'm around uh, Chul Chulona. Oh, like okay. All right. Driving, but I was coming from uh, Apopa City Box. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. so, uh, Is it I raining just, in Apopa? Yeah, it's a little. It's, it's tough rain. Right, right. Yes, yes I didn't I, understand. You're going to Apopa? No, he's coming a from a popa. He's coming from. Ah, a popa. He's coming from. Okay. Yes, I'm going to Santa Tecla. A long way. What about traffic? How is traffic right now? No, it's it's very clear. Yes, it's clear. Yes. Okay. Good. Good. No traffic. All right. Mm -hmm. Good. All right. Let's uh -huh. go back to the main session. Okay. Ah, sure. All right. No, it's safe, Daniel. All right. Hello, hello. Any questions or comments about the article you guys were discussing? No? Okay, I guess not. Your silence answers for you. All right, so uh, let's have a quick listening activity. Uh, share screen, share screen, share. Uh, new share, computer sound. Uh, here it is. Let me know if you can hear it. Not now, not now, not now. It will start soon. Questions 22 through 24. Can you hear it? Okay, here we go, pay attention. If you want to take notes, take notes. At the end of the audio, there are three questions. So take all the relevant information you feel is necessary. Here we go. Refer to the following advertisement. Are you looking for the perfect place to celebrate your wedding, 
graduation, retirement, or other special occasion, the world-famous Lakeview Restaurant has several party rooms available, all with a spectacular view of Lake George or of our old-fashioned English garden. Our rooms can accommodate anywhere from 15 to 75 guests. Meal prices start at $35 per person for a three-course meal, including a soup or salad course, entree and dessert, and a cash bar. Bands, photographers, and decorations are also available for an extra charge. To discuss your party arrangements and learn more about our services and prices, please call Martha Maddox, our party consultant, at 555-3177. Celebrate your special occasion on the beautiful shores of Lake George. Spring is our busiest season, so make your reservations now. Number 22. What is being advertised? What is being advertised, class? What are they announcing? About the restaurant. Good. Yeah. Okay. A uh, place to uh, celebrate and... birthdays and or weddings. Okay. Good. Yeah. All right. Party two. Number 23. Party two, yeah. What is the lowest price per person? What is the lowest price? 35. 35. 35 is correct. Very good. Number 24. What is not included in this price? What is not included in, in those $35? Decoration. Photographer. De Photographer, yes. Photographer is one. Anybody else? Okay, I'm going to play it one more time. It's, it's barely a minute. Here we go. Okay. okay. Questions 22 through 24 refer to the following advertisement. Are you looking for the perfect place to celebrate your wedding, graduation, retirement, or other special occasion? The world-famous Lakeview Restaurant has several party rooms available, all with a spectacular view of Lake George or of our old-fashioned English garden. Our rooms can accommodate anywhere from 15 to 75 guests. Meal prices start at $35 per person for a three-course meal, including a soup or salad course, entree and dessert, and a cash bar. Bands, photographers, and decorations are also available for an extra charge. To discuss your party arrangements and learn more about our services and prices, please call Martha Maddox, our party consultant, at 555-3177. Celebrate your special occasion on the beautiful shores of Lake George. Spring is our busiest season, so make your reservations now. Okay, so uh, what was the second question? What is not included in, the, in this price? Decoration. Decoration? Mm. Photography. Okay, photography is one. And what is the other one? Bands. Bands. Live music. <laughs> Live uh, music. Bands. Bands. So if, if you want a, a photographer to be there, if you want to have live music, you can have it, but you're going to have to pay extra. Yes. Okay. Any questions or comments about this audio? Teacher, I didn't understand the, when they were saying the, the food. Uh -huh. uh, the, that there were three, three what? Three, three cores. Three, three cores. Three cores. Three what cores. is that? This, so the this. meal has three things. <laughs> It can be chicken, uh -huh. rice, and salad. Or it can be chicken, salad, and soup. So they're, they're giving you three different components for each meal. Okay. And they have five. Three. Five. Three, three, three or five. Three cores. Three cores. Oh, three cores. Okay. okay. So 
let's say uh, the dish of food is going to be uh, whatever price, they have to give you an explanation of what the dish has. So in this mm -hmm. case, when they say a three course meal, they will give you three different things. Course meal, three course, yes. like, yeah. like course, like curso. Yes, exactly. Three course, three course meals, okay. Right. <laughs> or when, when you say the main course, uh, call the restaurant and you say the name, ask them for the main course, so the main dish, mm -hmm. the main food. Okay. Yes. Any other questions or comments? No? No. Okay. No. So, so we have 15 minutes. Those 15 minutes will be used for your speaking to improve your fluency, your accuracy. And today, how do you spend your free time? What do you usually do if you have free time? Mm -hmm. What is that? <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So uh, let me show you today's um, topic will be radio. Do you listen to the radio? Only nope. in, in the car. <laughs> Only in the car. Only in Never. the car. Okay, never. Okay, what about when you were younger? Oh, yeah. yes. All day, the whole day. <laughs> yeah, all day, every day. Did, did, were you able to use a, a Walkman or a Discman? Uh, a Walkman. A Walkman. So Walkman. I, used, I used Walkman and Discman as well. And then the iPod Shuffle, I don't remember the name. So, okay, so here you have a set of questions that you need to ask and answer when I assign you to work in pairs. Let me see here. Breakout rooms, recreate, recreate. -da -da. Uh, this person goes here and the others have a partner already. So, Let's do this. Talk about the radio. If you don't listen to the radio anymore, but you did when you were younger, explain why.
the radio, I think, not is important right now because we we, we have different application uh, for listening music, and uh, almost people have internet. Uh, so in my life, I think that is important. But uh, I think we have people who uh, still uh, listen to the radio. Yes, uh, yeah, I sometimes just I listen to the radio when I drive driving and I just wanted to know about the traffic or. Oh, ah, okay, okay. And I. Uh -huh. uh, El oficio. Okay. I see. De la, ah, no sé. Um, <laughs> more uh, wrong. <laughs> I have, it's important because you can get news. When I is, I. What? I mean, uh, they don't use the television because in my computer and YouTube, uh, I see the different the different topic. Uh, for example, um, news, uh, movies, and tutoriales. Uh, in the movies, I like the movies, the romantic new movies. Uh, then I don't I don't use the television. Oh, that's good. Uh -huh. yeah. Normally, nowadays, the, the television is a second plan, right? Uh, yes. Because the computer is better because uh, there are many information. Yes, yes. It's, it's, uh, I agree with you. You <laughs> use oh. audiphonos. Oh, my God. Imagine. I'm going to I'm going to try to look for that device. But I'm not I, sure I but... said I search one. I I sent for you one picture. If I, you remember that. Uh, okay. Okay. The second one said, "How important is the radio in your life?" Mm, just for emergencies. Maybe if uh, for the, the traffic. <laughs> yeah, maybe if uh, something important is is happening. For example. Uh, how do you say, recorte? Mm -hmm. uh, I have problem using that. Well, yes. uh, this is where a do, uh -huh. Okay. The next one is where uh -huh. do you, where do you usually listen to the radio? Ah, the car. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I only hear in my home. Sometimes yeah. when I when I am working, I mm -hmm. I like to hear. Okay. I love I love Daniel. <laughs> Hi. Which Daniel? Which question were you discussing? We discussed about the, the, the radio programs. If the the what kind of radio programs do you prefer to listen to? Uh-huh. Said to Daniel that I remember that when I was in the uh, writing for my work, I only hear the, the box FM at, at, at the morning and I try to to remember the name of the, uh, the it's a program, uh, Deportivo, the Deportes Box FM. Okay, all right. And they was very funny. Okay. But it was in two or three years ago. Okay. Okay. Yeah. When I when I listen to the radio, I usually listen to um, Laser. I like the music they play there. Good music. Uh, yeah. I don't. I don't. You. I don't hear that kind of radio. I okay. only put ABC radio. Okay. The, for me, it's the the top of the radio. All right. Good. Good. I always hear the radio when I when I driving. Okay. To my walk, to the team. Uh -huh. But in my house, I put the uh, YouTube or Spotify. Okay. Good. Good. Yeah. Uh, same here. When I when I'm at home, you know, if I listen to music, I 
watch YouTube. You know, mm -hmm. I don't really play the 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 radio that much. Yeah, yeah me too. All right. But I know a lot of people that they they put the radio and they are listening to radio. They they talk to the to the radio set and yeah. I don't know. Maybe they they like to 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 talk to the. I don't know how do you say the. The what? The the person in the radio. The DJ. Ah, presenter, the DJ. The DJ. Uh huh. Okay. All right. Always the people talk to the DJ. Right. Right. Okay. Well, All right. Good. Let's go back to the menu. 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 Let's All right. Ladies and gentlemen, do you have any questions about today's class? Mm, nope. It's about the, que <laughs> the, the number five question. I have a question. Uh -huh. Yes, <laughs> what is it? Do you think radio is making a comeback with the internet? Uh huh. What, what is comeback meaning? Uh, is, it, is it returning? Is it returning? Uh, because some people say that we're losing radio. You know, it depends on the generation that you belong to. But with the internet, is it making a comeback? Uh, yes. Yes, because the radio, the radio can be here by internet. Right, All by right. internet. Mm -hmm. Exactly, exactly. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Any other questions? Anybody else? No? Okay, so don't forget, we finish tomorrow. Make sure that you complete the platform. And thank you for your time. I'll be seeing you tomorrow, same place, same time. Have a good night. Have a good night. You too. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.